morning. Today I want to share with you a scientific evolution. We respect Darwin and all the scientists. You know the evolution is totally scientific. But unfortunately, every science, scientific person, because they are using their intellectual mind, they want to prove that 2 to 2 is 4. And that is true. But they do not understand the real science of evolution. You know, it is more than 4,000 billion years ago, the earth was created. 500 billion years ago, a single cell was created. And 60 million years ago, a human body came, a human came from monkey. And that's what Darwin said. And it is true. Now the question is that this evolution, scientific evolution, is a total consciousness. And our cellular system is totally unconditional consciousness. And that's where the healing takes place. Now, in our body, thoughts creates emotions, the feelings, and then we produce actions. And we again, from that actions, we put thoughts again, the feeling, the emotions, and we create a behavior. And as we keep on creating that behavior, from our past and from our future and from our mind, we totally getting biologically conditioned and we wrap in ourselves and we trap in ourselves and we become slave to ourselves, to the society and to the whole world because we want to make mighty dollar. And that is real science, but we are running towards the mighty dollar. Scientific evolution, if you compare that, the human body which is totally conditioned unconscious, that is conditioned unconsciousness as a comparable to animals, they don't have mind phenomena, they have no competition, they have total clarity, they have creativity, they have no goal except for preservation. And what we do, we use our intellectual mind and we have a duality, competition and we have no clarity but we are trying to have a greed, ego, the pride and we are trying to create for this human body a biological drugs. But you know our body has an evolutionary memory. It has a built-in what you call a memory, it has also has intelligence, biological intelligence, which is more than artificial intelligence. And if we use that biological intelligence with evolutionary memory, and that is totally scientific and totally become unconditional, you can heal yourself from cancer, heart disease, diabetes. Alzheimer's and so on. But the biggest disease is a cancer. And we are scared. And we are going to the doctor, and he or she is also trapped with a conditioned unconsciousness. And they are playing with that all the physical examination, your history, and then do all the testing, and then they make a diagnosis. And the diagnosis come from where? It came from Medicare because the Medicare will only pay to these people if they make a diagnosis and there's a code for it. And when the procedure is done, that's also have a code. And then they put amount of money has to be built. So now you can see how that system is totally buckled up. And that's where scientific evolution plays a role. The transformation of Medicare in the United States has to be done. It is more than 100 years. And it has become its own enemy. And there's 
though they are covering more than 65 million people and they're spending more than 700 billion dollars the new president from the democratic they're trying to give medicare to all and it will cost more than 25 to 30 trillion dollars now you can see how confusion it is we are running away from ourselves we are losing that responsibility we are losing that clarity and we are running towards competition the ego the economy and so on and we are creating and we have created totally conditioned unconsciousness and we cannot heal that cancer through that condition unconsciousness unless you really understand yourself and learn how to understand the inner science that is scientific evolution the condition called the unconditional consciousness that's what jesus talked about and i request all of you because i've just finished this book called the cancer cure cancer at home naturally i request all of you to please go to our website Go to Amazon Kindle and get this book. Read it and talk to your family practitioner, the medical doctor, the health, what you call the health practitioner, so that you can do the best job and heal yourself. Also, go to our app, Jesus Now. I request all of you to stay happy and healthy. God bless. Namaste. Amen.